What's up, traders? Today has been a ten thousand dollar, actually nine thousand dollar day. Uh, I, I I I I traded two tickers today. My my two tickers were uh, ANTD and APDN. I lost two times on two other tickers, and there was plenty of opportunity to make today, despite the fact that Mark is down three hundred and ninety two points. First off, we have AMTD. Uh, the stock was up 500% at one point. It closed at $2 and it ran up all the way to $14, which was pretty retarded. $14 is a pretty high number. So you had buy-ins, broker buy-ins. You have, uh, uh, you know, you had a lot of, uh, you know, parabolic price action. Everybody was pouring into their money in AMTD. After that, the money flow went to the APDN. Which ended up going from 120 to like 180, and now it's halted into the 230s. And um, took a couple small losses on Elog and Rev. I was trying to buy Rev as it broke pre-market highs at 980, but it's just it's having trouble with the 10 dollar round number, even though it's back there. So I definitely chased um, Revlon, it was, but my biggest gain was in AMTD as a long. As I was buying it, uh, you know, it had a, it had two daily resistance. The daily resistance were around, uh, the daily resistance was eight dollars, and then it, when it broke, eight dollars, it held eight dollars, and then continued on. It squeezed into the pre-market all the way to fourteen. So I'm gonna go review my trades with you. Uh, so you can see here my best trade was uh, AMTD. My best trade was AMTD. AMTD. My my best trade was AMTD. I was buying it at 870s, 862 and 860. So after I figured out that, you know, AMTD was a 52 week breakout, AMTD 52 week breakout over here. You can see the 786 daily breakout over here. So it broke 8 and then I logged it initially at 8 over here. And then I sold at 8. I was trying to go short at one point. Because I didn't think it was going to go much higher. So I bought it at 8. Hit a high of like 860. Came back down and held 8. And I'm like, oh, it's just going to it's just gonna, it's just gonna break 8. Be a fake out breakout. And then I started shorting at 8. And then I thought it's just going to go like they normally do. Which was like this. That's kind of like my game plan. And when I saw that that wasn't the case, I went long. I covered my short. And I went long. And it held this trend. And I held it all the way to up to like an 11.12. And I ended up making 25% on a lot of shares. It was very liquid. It was uh, 300000 on the one minute. Uh, and I, I sold some into the 11s after I longed it in 866, 870, and 860. I ended up selling most into the 11 something, 11.28. My other trade today was APDN and, and ended up making going to 14.5. And then uh, pretty much after it hit 14.5, I think it just it just went to the crapper. All the money was just infected into the stock. APDN was uh, another stock that pretty much going to the moon. I was watching around this range here, how it did a VWAP reclaim. Um, the the stock pretty much uh, had a VWAP reclaim over here. I was buying it at 124, 123, sold 154 and 169. Into this push over here, ACON. hit like 180, and now it's like halted, going vertical here to the 230s. So I ended up making a 3k win on that. My I had a couple of losses here. Rev, uh, AMDT. That was my AMDT when I was starting to short. Uh, and then I covered my short and went long. And then you had Elock here. I bought it a couple times, but it, it, it didn't give any. It didn't give any any volume here. I was trying to buy the the daily break of 280. Stopped out at 260 on this candle. So I definitely and I bought the VWAP break over here of 270 or, or 280, and then got stopped out in this candle. So not all of them are gonna work out. Uh, but you know, capitalizing on the old stocks that do. Today is uh, an amazing 10K, 10K day, and uh, 
And I'm just gonna wake up and uh, start again tomorrow. Today was a uh, three hour trading so far. Uh, three hour trading. ACON. I'm very happy with my amazing uh, trading. And that's about it. I, uh, I should have made uh, better trades in um, APDN over here and not chase Revlon. APDN has been a, a stock that went vertical. And it's still halted on the way up, but it's, uh, you know, it's about 10 o'clock. I finished up my day. Uh, it was, um, it was <laughs> a very good day. And uh, uh, we had a lot of vertical movers, a lot of irrational movers. And uh, I'm just going to walk. It's been a pleasure having you on. Make sure you sign up to my uh, YouTube live stream. Uh, YouTube live stream. That is going to be, um, uh, make sure you sign up to my live streams on uh, Zoom. Uh, the link is in the description below. What did you trade? Did you make money? Make sure you like this video. And uh, other than that, YouTube, see you guys on Thursdays. And for subs, I'll see you guys tomorrow at 7 o'clock a.m. Peace out. It was, it was an awesome day for me. And uh, 9K day, I think is 8K day. Nike, a 9K day. Peace.